Hi everybody, it's Mama D coming back at you with Papa D hello, to hello. <clears throat> watch the fifth episode or sixth episode of the first season of House of Dragons. So last week was the wedding and that was interesting. Mm. Sir Cole, Kristen Cole killed um, Lenar's uh, boyfriend and just beat his face in the end. <clears throat> and at the end, the king fell to the ground. So we don't know did the king die or what happened. But the wedding, they hurried up and got him married off uh, instead of waiting the seven days because all, you know, the crap had hit the fan. So no. let's find out what happens on this one. I'd say childbirth. What do you think? Or a kidney stone? <laughs> hmm. And push. Nope. Childbirth. That gushy sound. <laughs> Sounds gross. Boy, princess. Boy, mother. All right, so we had a time jump. Hmm. That's uh, the new Daenerys, or the new, I want to say Daenerys, the new Rhaenyra. Princess, the queen has requested that the child be brought to her oh. immediately. Why? I'll take it myself. You. you should remain a bed, princess. Yes, I should. Help me dress. <laughs> I was going to say, are they going to cut the cord, or what are they doing? The afterbirth. <laughs> that gushy sound is gross. Mm. Ah! A boy. I just heard. Mm. What is it? What is it? What is it? Seriously, she just pushed her placenta out, and you're going to make her climb up all them steps? Thank you. So, Daddy ain't dead yet, then. Seems like <clears throat> that might be some stuff that really gotten worse with her and uh, the queen. Mm -hmm. Why would she ask her to do that? Well, at the end, she found out that she lied to her and she was messing with Cole. So that was like a betrayal because she believed her mm -hmm. that she hadn't. Rhaenyra, you should be resting oh. after your labors. I have no doubt that you would prefer that, Your Grace. You must. What happy oh, news this morning. Still alive. Indeed, Your Grace. Where is he? I do believe he has his father's nose. Uh-oh. Because <laughs> that ain't his daddy. Mm-hmm. She don't want her touching it. I do hope the labor was easy. I think I <laughs> called the midwife a cunt. Oh. <laughs> labor will make you do weird things like that. Do you keep trying, Selena? Sooner or later, you may get what it looks like you. Oh! Mother! Look! Okay. She's got two other kids, so. We chose an egg for the baby. Ah. And that's the hand, son. The real strong man guy. Mm -hmm. That must be who's the baby's daddy. Another boy, I heard. They definitely don't look like Lenore. Mm hmm. Fine night you're going to make, eh? Night I. So Harwin wishes to be introduced. Of Joffrey. course. So they all know this, right? Oh, yeah. oh, okay. Okay. Of course. Joffrey, is it? You ain't got to say nothing, just the look between them. You know that's the baby's daddy. Mm -hmm. And Lenore knows who he did. Mm -hmm. is. And the queen knows, because the queen's like... I don't know like, how they figured that, you know, this baby does not have any... White hair or... You know, <laughs> no darkness about it. No Good morning, Good morning.
They got to train him, I guess, huh? Mm-hmm. Oh, we're giving you a joke. Vamos! Vamos! Feliz! Feliz! Aww. Oh, God, he's creepy looking. Burmax. Is Aegon the one with the blonde hair? The tallest? That one there? Or no, that's... That's her kids, the Queen's kids. Dracarys Burmax. Okay, sure. The boy and the girl. That's Aegon. <laughs> That's you, Joe. Wow. Damn. I have raised this matter before. And you forbade me to speak of it, so I held my tongue. Time to get out. We gotta talk. <laughs> Your grandkids aren't Targaryen. To have one child like that is a mistake. To have three is an insult. To the throne, to you. Have I lost my sanity, Sir Criston? Do my senses lead me astray, or is everyone else asleep, <laughs> dreaming the same woolly dream? Sometimes seems so, you're right. So he's been... What the hell? Who is that? Hmm. Uh, is that Aegon? <laughs> ah! Whose idea is it? <laughs> <laughs> Put it back in your pants, dude. So somewhere along the line, she had a third child mm -hmm. in this t in this time jump. Yeah. Oh, that's cool, isn't it? Hmm. Is that Damon? Mm-hmm. See? So they got to go. That's like riding a crazy roller coaster. Woo! <laughs> Somebody pregnant? Was she rubbing a belly? Mm-hmm. <clears throat> His wife? Yeah. You are considering Prince Reggio's offer. We have a good life here. We're free to do as we please. Welcomed and fettered. And eternally guessed. Precisely. We are without responsibility. Who's <coughs> spar with Aegon? <laughs> eldest son against eldest son. <laughs> Your interest in the princeling's training is quite unusual, Commander. Most men would only have that kind of devotion toward a cousin or a brother. Or a son. <coughs> Ooh! <coughs> Uh-oh. <coughs> Get your face beat in like... The son of a steward. He is a knight of the king's guard now. Sailed like the a feather of future heir to the throne. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! You have laid us open to accusation. Thank you. You'll feel better in a day or two. When the milk dries up. So what they feed him with in them days? Where they what? She said you'll feel better in a few days when your milk dries up. So what they feed him with in them days? I oh. thought they all breastfed. <clears throat> well, I'm sure they sent out and got some info mail. Hmm. They sent out and got some info mail. Oh, he's got a boyfriend. As your princess and the heir to the throne, you are commanded to remain in King's Landing and at my side. Going rank. <laughs> mm. Well, that was that. Who you know, I can't argue with her. Leonor has written. Rhaenyra has delivered another son. 
Does your brother mention if this one also bears a marking but entirely coincidental resemblance to the commander of the city watch? <laughs> I have felt the strife between our families of late, my queen. And for any offence given by mine, I apologise. But we are one house. Long before that, we were friends. My son, Jocerus, will inherit the Iron Throne after me. I propose we betroth him to your daughter, Helena. Additionally, if Cyrax brings forth another clutch of eggs, your son, Aemond, will have his choice of them. Uh, a symbol of our goodwill. Mm. How sweetly the fox speaks when it's being cornered by the hound. She is sincere. She is desperate. She feels the earth washing away from her feet. She's right, she's now she's it moves in its hair. I know. You speak kind words. That's true. But there is a shadow over my house, and it grows ever darker. I can no longer uh -oh. serve you with integrity. Uh. What is this shadow? Name it if it casts such a gloom. Come on yes. now, you know. You must have your reasoning in plain language. Of course she wants him to say it. <clears throat> <laughs> I cannot. Mm. Then I cannot accept this. My dear husband. I said no. You're going to help me. <laughs> oh, she just walked out. Lord Lionel is to escort Sir Harwin back to Harren Hall to watch over his seat whilst he continues to serve his hand. But the hand is compromised by the axe of his son. I am prepared to offer you mercy if you're prepared to pay a little price. Oh no! Oh, what's he doing? Cutting his tongue off? And, and soldered it? Damn. Hmm. Oh, no yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I hope it's not breach. Here we go again. Yep, something's wrong. I breached the limit of my art. Child will not come. What's she doing? Dracarys! She wants you to burn it? Like kill her? Mm-hmm. He's like, no, I ain't gonna can't kill you. You're my mommy. <laughs> That's a different kind of suicide. Suicide by dragon. <laughs> right. Dang. I will return. Do they know he's their daddy? I promise. I don't know. Or they Seems just like everybody kind of knows about this at one point or another. Father! <laughs> <laughs> how strong my father. Ooh. Am I Thank a bastard? You are a Targaryen. That's what the matter is. Oh my god. They set him on fire? Yeah. What? Hmm, hmm, hmm. Hmm. They made sure that wasn't going to continue. Mm -mm. 
Well, I knew. I figured he wasn't just going to walk away. Right. That's treason what he did. Who's that? But for them, you surrender what you should not. I don't know who these guys are here. Oh my God, burnt her to a crisp. Dang. I assume you will write to your father now. Paris. Oh, he's a bad guy. I did not mm -hmm. wish for this. Killed his own brother. I right. feel certain you brother. will reward me. Man. When the time is right. Man. Hmm. That was another one. Another good yeah. episode. These clip wow. tape hangers, you know. I know. Got to wait a week for the next one. Yeah. All right. Well, make sure that you like, subscribe, and share. And go to patreon.com slash mama D for a dollar. You can watch all the full reactions. And we will see you next week on the next one. Peace out. Peace.